terrific night of hockey here. Eddie Olchek is alongside. You'll hear from Ray Ferraro in a moment. I'm Mike Emery. The teams have taken to the ice, and it's setting up to be a terrific matchup. Eddie, your thoughts? This is the game you mark on your calendar with a big red circle with a thick, fat marker. The fans are pumped, and the players are ready to rock. Let's get it on. And the faceoff's won. Into the attacking end. Good shooting place. But covered, whistle blown. Korpakoski's ability to read the play was pretty good there as he got across to make the stop on that odd man rush. Team Finland's in control as they travel up the wing. From the outside, score! Finland has come through big time! Oshie's wrist shot was heavy and quick. Man, the top glove edzo was wide open. He drops into a butterfly. You could throw a football in there right now. Still has control up the wing. Drill. Got his stick on it. Score! And the game is even. He's got a nose for the net, and especially scoring goals off the rebound. Oh, the goaltender's got to do a better job of that one, Edzo. He makes that first stop, but he leaves the rebound too close to the net where the goal scorer can grab it. Directing that one to Gotch. Oh, broke it up! Play is stopped, and now we'll hear the call. Leopold's going to the box, and the call is tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Face-off win here. A shot! Score! It's a power play. You can keep the puck to the outside, but at some point, you got to get the puck to the middle of the ice. That's what they do, and they're rewarded with a power play goal. Really good positioning. He's in the butterfly where he's got most of the net. Up to the point. And he hammers one. And we get a penalty here. The referee strides over to hand it out. The Finns have been handed a minor penalty for tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. The difference in the game is just one goal, and it came late in that period. Will it springboard to something more in the second? We'll see, but for now, we go to break. The ice, so nothing good happening there. Even though he's really banged up, he's going to try and suck this up and finish the shift. Gotcha's leadership is one of putting points on the board. He's not a guy that has to be physical. It's not a guy that has to fight, but he's got to score and he's created offense again tonight. Finland's guilty of a game misconduct, and the shower head is sprinkling. Germany's moving the puck along the side. One-timer, a lightning-like glove save. Puck covered, whistle blown. The Finns need to acknowledge their goaltender after one of the better saves you will ever see. Somebody get this guy a stake. 
Germany's forced another turnover in this very close game. Extra man over the boards on this delayed penalty call. Long way to go and not much time to do it. Right on his stick from the left wing. And we get a penalty. Referee to the table, a player to the box. Sawatsky's going to the box. It's a tripping minor. I'm going to give credit to the puck carry here. He kept his legs moving. He forced the back checker to reach in and take him off. There's nowhere to hide in this game. There's no out of bounds. Broke it right up into the corner. Toward the goal mount. Terrific shot. Penalty call coming. Watch for his signal here. Germany's given a minor here for tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Your power play doesn't find a way to come through for you. You have a chance to tie the game, and you just can't get it done. That's two periods in the books. One more to go, but a rest comes first. Hey, fans, we'd like to draw your attention to the far part of the arena where we're welcoming all of our minor hockey kids here in attendance tonight. The Germans have the lead, and with goaltending like this, they might just keep it. But we'll have to see after we go to break. Germany's accelerating on in neutral ice. Harkobus just hopped. He scores! Second of the game. What a performance. The goalie was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. Edzo, the goaltender's too quick to rely on his technique. He drops down quickly. That opens up the top of the net and too much room there for a shooter of this quality. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Number 55. Let's the shot fly. Score! The hat trick. It's not really loud in here, but they don't expect that. Well, the goalie can't do much about this, Eddie. The pass goes off that defenseman's giant foot. the wing. Turned a shot on now. And yet again, here is Ray Ferrar. Doc and Edzo will take a look back at the hat trick. He's finished from some very difficult spots on the ice, but has been an exceptional player throughout. Thanks, Ray. Yeah, he has been remarkable in this game tonight. Fun to watch. They're up now by three. They win the draw. Fires. They score. A tremendous goal for Team Finland. This is one shot I wish more young hockey players would use. Everybody wants to take the big slapper. It's not how hard you shoot it. It's how quick it comes off your stick. And that was quick. And so I got a good look at this one. He's in the butter. And play is stopped for a penalty. Seidenberg's getting a minor for slashing. Back in the era of wood sticks, this would really hurt. That's a slash. It seemed like a three-goal lead was going to be enough. It's less enough now. That lead has dwindled to two, and there's still a goalie pull possibility. Gets across, looks over his options. Referee over to the penalty box, and let's find out. Keeping's got a minor penalty here for interference. Clearly an interference call not allowing the player to get involved into the play. Just a backhand. Game over, and so the end of a very close game. 
The stats can be deceptive. The shots on goal were really lopsided, but the score was tight. Sometimes you're going to have games like this where you get a lot of pucks to the net and they don't go in, but you win the game. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.